Hi there, this is Dina and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm here to plan for the week of April 9th through the 15th and I'm going to be using this kit here. This is a foiled kit and it's in silver foil by Nicole Alexia Designs and I did just pick up the mini kit so it doesn't, there are more things if you pick up her full kits but here are the full boxes. Here's a functional page and I might have this out of order so sorry about that. With the weekend banner, some like text script things here, your sidebar, regular circle icons, and your checklist. Here's your bottom washi, which is so pretty. Regular washi, some appointment labels, I think you call those, and then some half boxes. And here's all your headers and little things and some more half boxes there. So I'm going to go ahead and get started. I did also pull out a few, well actually a lot again washi tapes so here's my big fat stack of washi again and I'm gonna go ahead and take out my inserts and before I get started I'll just go ahead and say these are inserts that are printable inserts from our shop they're sized to fit inside of a happy planner but they will are formatted for the Erin Condren kits so that's why they look different than the normal happy planner um, inserts that come in the happy planner so I'm going to go ahead and zoom in just a little bit and I'm going to go ahead and start off with the bottom washi and I love the bottom washi in this kit so I am going to use that and I will probably incorporate some of the other washi that I brought out just because I've been liking doing that lately. So I like to bring this all the way down to the bottom here and yeah I'm going to do that. Hopefully I get it straight. It is a little harder for me to get it straight when I do that, but usually it ends up being okay. So, there we go. And sometimes I like to wait to add the second layer till later on in the spread just because it's kind of easier to see how it's all going to come together, which one will look better, if that makes sense. So, yeah. And I am, this video will be going up a little bit early because I had some extra time and I decided to do my video before the weekend got busy. So I'm doing this early. It's going to come up early. And I apologize if my schedule's not always, my videos don't come up at the same time every week. But unfortunately, my life doesn't work that way. It's, there's a lot of inconsistencies. So it's just going to come up when I have time. So if that bothers you, I'm sorry, but that's just the way my life is. So it's going to go that way. I'm going to go ahead and start with the full boxes here. And I really love this saying, especially this week, April showers bring May flowers. And that's the reason why I picked this kit for this week, because we are having a ton of rain right now. And it makes me happy because I love the rain. Um... Unfortunately, living where we do in California, we don't get a lot of rain, but um, yeah, I'm a huge fan of the rain, so it's pouring down this week a lot, and so this kit is perfect, and anyways, I could live in a place where it rains all the time and be completely happy, to be honest with you. Uh, most people think that's weird, but I just love the rain. All right, so the full boxes, most of them are foiled. I will have an extra one, so it's either going to be this one or this one. Um, so I'm just gonna, it doesn't really matter to me how I lay these down, um, but I do think I want this one not to go on the bottom, and I'm gonna stagger. So I'm gonna put that one down first just so it doesn't go on the bottom, and I'm gonna put it on Monday just because it's Monday, not my favorite day, and that'll make it a little bit prettier of a day just because it's such a pretty sticker. Well, they're all pretty, but you know what I mean extra pretty there we go and then I'll just go ahead and stagger them from there and I think I'm gonna save this one for over here one of these two I mean uh, just because and I will put the flowers down here I think actually I want the flowers up here no rhyme or reason just filling it so I hope you guys all had a good week um, I did. It's pretty good. A lot of unexpected things happened, but they turned out to be, you know, for the better. Like the outcome 
turned out better than what I expected. So sometimes when things go wrong, they end up um, being better, if that makes sense. They went wrong for a reason, right? Because I think everything does happen for a reason. So I'm going to go ahead and put the other ones over here. And I think I'm going to put, um, I'll put this one down here. And I do like this one better, so I'm going to use that over here. And then I'll stagger from there, right? Yeah. Just to kind of spread it out. And I really want this one on the weekend. I don't know why. It just kind of reminds me of a weekend banner or something. Their little window. This kit is so pretty. So I'll put this guy up here. Oops. I'm so crooked on me. A little crooked, but that's okay. I'm going to leave it. And then I will put the other two. I'm going to put the flower. I'm going to put the flower down here and then the boots up top. I think the boots is my favorite one out of this whole spread. I don't know why, but my favorite full kit, full, full box out of this kit. Yeah. So it is pretty early in the morning when I'm filming this, so if I'm not awake yet, I apologize. But why not get it done while everyone's sleeping and it's quiet? The neighbors aren't awake yet, so it should be quiet. All right, so we got the full boxes down um, for the headers this week. That's what I'm going to do next. I am going to use the ones that came in the kit for today and to do. So I'm going to use those. And I brought out some silver uh, foil headers to put on top of the boxes. So I think I'm going to do that. And I did also bring out some date covers because I bought the mini kit so it didn't come with date covers. So I think this light blue color will go and it's in silver foil from our shop. So I am going to use that and some clear silver foil date dots that um, got attacked by the sticker mat or the cutting mat. So that's why it looks a little funny there. This is an oopsie. So that's what I'm going to use and the checklists that come with the kit. So I am going to cut these down and last week I cut them down to four, but I only need three, I figured. So I'm going to do that and I think I'll start with these first and then we'll kind of put all this stuff together. We're going to just go ahead and do Monday first and see how everything looks. So let's cut these down. I'm just going to cut one to start with. And I like to put these down before the headers. For some reason I can just line them up straighter that way. So that's why I do that first. And let's do that. And then the to-do header will go on top of this guy. There we go. So, And then the today will go where there's nothing yet so far. The only thing about this is that my date covers are blue. So I don't know if that's going to look funny, having the two blue up there. So I might just switch it and... Well, yeah, I'm going to just, I'll, I'll know what it means by to do and today, and I'm going to switch it anyways, so let's do that. This will still be my to-do list, even though it says today, <laughs> and yeah, just so the colors kind of go better a little bit. And then the silver foil headers are ones that I just made myself. We don't sell these in our shop. Okay. That's going to go there. I think that looks cute. And then for the date covers, I'm going to use the light blue, like I said. And Monday is the 9th, so I want to pull off one of these. And these are clear, so you won't be able to see the white, which is nice for day covers like these so I am going to put that down here cute and I'll pop this guy up top so let's see let me see if I'm lining it up straight because I think I put that header down crooked so let's try it okay 
So that's how the layout's going to go for this week for my headers and my date covers and my checklist. So I'm going to go ahead and lay that all down off camera and I'll be right back with you guys. Okay, so we have all of the main structure laid out. Um, I am going to go on to the sidebar next. Over here, I don't think I'm going to need any checklists this weekend, so that's why there aren't any. Um, I'm just going to move that paper out of the way. And this week for my sidebar, I am going to start off with the um, habit trackers, but I think I want to put this down first, this bottom washi, so I forgot about that. So I am going to stick with this pink one just because I wanted to bring out more of the pink in this spread. So this is from uh, Simply Gilded and it's kind of silver. I think this is called holographic? Holo graphic? I don't know. Whatever. That, you could just tell me down in the description box below, but I forgot what this is called. So I am going to put this down here, but those lines are showing through. So let me just see if I can white those out really quick. And I am so bad at using white out. That's why I, I think I get frustrated with it a lot of the time, but if I think about it when I'm doing it, I can do a pretty good job, like just put even pressure and, you know, put it down, but when I don't put even pressure along the, you know, this, then it kind of goes side, you know, cattywampus, so there we go. We got that down, so let's go ahead and put this bottom washi down, which I just kind of stuck to everything. So yeah, I'm going to use this one and I'm going to put this right here and I'm going to kind of center it between the two hopefully just to leave a little white space like that and I'll just trim it with my ruler the edge. Sometimes I have a hard time with the smaller washi trimming it with my ruler but it seems to be going okay so far. I guess I could have cut this end off. Alright, so yeah, I think I like the pink. I'm glad I used, used that just to kind of bring out the pink in the kit a little bit more. So yeah, I'm going to continue that over here. Hopefully I'm getting that straight. Okay, and I shouldn't have pushed that down all the way. So I'm going to have to try to peel that up. Let's see. And I didn't bring out my X-Acto knife, so let me see if I can peel this up real quick here. You should be able to peel up. It's washy. Yeah. Alright, I think it's going to work. Hopefully it'll tear. If not, I'll just trim it later. Oh, I got it. Yay! Okay. Alright, so there's that. Um, next we'll go to the sidebar. I think I like that. I'm glad I chose the pink. So for the sidebar, I'm going to start with my habit trackers first, but I think I want to put some of this washi up at the top too there, just to kind of get the sidebar going. So yeah, I'm going to start with this here. Actually, no, I'm not because that's pink. Change my mind. I do have a blue one, so maybe I'll do the blue up at the top. Yeah, let's do that. So I'll put this guy up here, and I'm going to just cut that little line out, or white out that little line, not cut it, just so it doesn't show through. Usually I forget to bring my white out out, but I remembered this time, so I'm happy about that because I think it'll look better without the line showing through in the background. So yeah. Does anyone else have a hard time using whiteout in their spreads besides me? Like, do you get into little disputes with it? Because <laughs> I do. Doesn't ever want to go down straight or, you know. Anyways, okay, let's go on to the habit tracker. So, there are two here. So, I'm going to, I don't think it matters which way I lay them down, to be honest. And I like to use two. So one will be for my invoices and one will be for emails. And I kind of want to see, I think she has a lot of cute little icons, so if she does have one, 
I should have whited that out too. I think that line is going to do the same thing. So let me just get rid of this line. I just think it'll look a little bit better. And yeah, I'm going to leave a little space there. Okay, so one's for invoices and one's for emails. For the emails, I'm going to use this little computer here. And then the other one I'm not going to worry about. So I'll put that up here. Do I, want to, I think I want it on this side just in case I want to put something over here. Okay, so that will be for emails and invoices. And then for my two weekly bars this week, I do want to try to track my fitness, so like my steps and my workouts a little bit better. So I am going to use two weekly bars this week. And I'm going to start with the pink one. And the other one will be for dinner. So one's for a workout and one's for dinner. So... I'm going to use probably some washi first from the kit, and then I'm going to put a workout sticker to mark that with one of these workout stickers from our shop in silver foil, and that's just a little oopsie, so you might see some little dots in it, but that doesn't bother me, so I was going to use the pink, but this box is pink, so I'm going to use this one here. I think that that will be big enough. Oops. I don't know if I mentioned, but this kit is on glossy sticker paper to this week. So I like to buy my foiled kits on glossy sticker paper. So yeah, I think I hear the neighbors waking up. So you might start to hear some loud people. <laughs> yeah, I hear them. All right, there we go. So I'm gonna use this to mark and what I want to do is put what I did for the workout and my steps. So maybe I could like put one on each side of each day. So I know I don't work out every day, but at least be able to fit them all in here. There we go. And I think I just put that really crooked. That's going to be hard to get up. Let's see if I can do it. Hopefully without ruining this sticker. Oh, I think I did it. I ruined the bottom sticker a little bit, but that's okay because I'm covering it back up. There we go. So that'll be for my workouts and steps. And then the next one's going to be for our dinners. So I'll use this one and some washi and then one of her headers. So because she does have, I don't think she has a meals header though, but she had it like this week. So yeah, I'll just do that. And I'll use... This one this time. Ah, they're all sticking together. <laughs> okay, so let's do that. And I think the meals will fit like right inside of that. Oops. Hopefully. I didn't want that to go down as far, but that's okay. We're just going to leave it. And I should have whited out that line. Still new at using the white out. So I'll get the hang of it. Let's see, yeah. So there's not a meal, so I'll use this week for our dinners. And just put it like right in the center here. And I think maybe she has like a little icon that I could use for that. Let's see. Oh, it's a fast food one. So maybe not. I don't see another one that would go. So we'll just do that. Okay, and then I need to put my 52 week savings tracker down at the bottom. So these are from Rasbrell Designs. So I'm going to put, try to squeeze a little piggy down here with probably just a thin strip of washi. So I was going to use that, but I'm not. So let's just use one of her washi again. And maybe I'll use the pink while I'm down there because she has this thin one here that should fit just right. Yeah, that's going to work. Okay. And then we'll put him right in the middle. I just like to put him the, in the same spot every week. Certain things I do like to keep in the same spot every week. And I want to put him low so I could still write on Sunday. So I'm just going to have to kind of write. I don't know. It'll fit. It'll work out. Alright, so there's my sidebar all done. 
Um, let's go ahead and go day by day. And I do need to do work labels this week because I am going back to work. Or I went back last week, but anyways, I have a full week of work. So I am going to use these hearts from Clever Gale Crafts. And I think I'm just going to use the pink ones. And I'm going to use some little things from the kit. So, yeah, that's what I'm going to do. And I think I like the light blue color, so I'll do that. Just, I like these two colors together. So I like to put my work labels down at the bottom of the box where my checklist is. Checklist R. I don't know which word I'm supposed to use there. Okay. So let's try that for Monday. And... I want to see if this helps me out a little bit because I'm having a hard time getting circle stickers down straight. Yeah, that should work. There we go. And yeah, so I'm going to do that for Monday, Tuesday, Thursday, and Friday. And I'm going to keep it all the same for the week for work. So let's put these all down first. And then we'll put, oh, and the hearts, I don't know if I said, are from, what's that shop? Uh, Clever Ale Crafts hearts, and they're in silver foil too. So I tried to pull out as much silver foil as I can for this spread, but honestly, I don't have a lot. So I don't, per, I don't know, silver is not my favorite foil, but it's still really pretty. I just don't use it a lot, so I don't have a lot, if that makes sense. So... Let's do that. But I am starting to get more. I mean, I can make myself some, but I don't know. Sometimes I am the worst at making myself my own stickers. I make them for everybody else and then not me. <laughs> so, all right. Oops, that stuck to the tweezers. So there's my work labels for the week. Um, Wednesday, I do have the day off, so I do need to grab my day off stickers. Let me grab those real quick. Okay, so I got my day off stickers, and these were um, in silver foil, too, from our shop. So I am going to put one of these down, and I kind of want to put it up here for some reason. Just because I think I could put something else down there if I do. So yeah, I'm going to try it. There we go. Yeah, I'm going to do that. Alright, so now we have our work labels down. I'm going to start going day by day. Um, for Monday, I do like to put a little coffee cup for Monday, just for coffee Monday. So I brought these silver foiled coffee cups out from our shop, and I wanted to use the one with the little bow on it. Um, because there's not a lot of bows in this kit, so I want to bring out some more bows. So I like to put them up here on Monday, just like that. Alright, and also on Monday, the only thing going on so far is that I want to go to the gym. And I think Kylie has practice, but I'm not sure yet because they haven't announced it yet. So I'm going to wait before I put that down. Um, they're really bad about getting us her schedule this year for her volleyball. So it's like last minute for everything. So I brought these for my gem stickers. And these are from Soda Pop Studio. And I am going to use the pink one. And they just say workout and they're little flags. I used these, I think, last week, but I really like them. So I'm going to use them again. And a lot of the colors match. So, oops. And these are on matte. She offers removable matte and glossy, but I bought all my stickers from her on the removable matte. So there's that for Monday. Um, I'm not sure about volleyball, so I can't really put that in. I know she's going to have a game, but like I said, I don't know the information. So I might not put any of her volleyball stuff in yet until later. So on to Tuesday, I have my um, a class that I have to go to, and it's Etsy Payday. So I'm going to put the Etsy Payday up here. And she has a really cute Payday sticker right here. So I'm going to use that for Etsy Payday. And I'm going to put it up here. So I think some washi might be cute behind that. Um, I do have this little skinny one, but I don't know if it's going to be too skinny. So, um, or I have this one, but that might be too big. So let me see how it works. I'm not sure where I got this one. It's either from Michael's, Joann's, or Hobby Lobby. So it's just a silver polka dot foil, and I think it's going to be too big. 
So I wonder if this little heart will lift up a little bit. It might not because it's probably already stuck down pretty good. Oh, it's lifting. So I'm going to just lift that guy up a little bit and put my washi up top just for a background for my um, payday sticker for Etsy payday to mark Etsy payday. So let's try to put this down here. There we go. Oh no, I ruined that heart a little bit. But I think I have extra so I can go back in and put that. So now where did I put my ruler? I think I dropped my ruler. Hang on one second. Okay, sorry about that. I always drop at least one thing. So last week I think I dropped my washi tape. So let's do that. Let's just cut the end of this off with my ruler here. And this is just the payday sticker from the kit, if I didn't say that already. And it's so cute. I like her little scripty stickers. So I'm going to put that right in the middle. There. Okay. And then, um, what else is going on? Oh, I have a class that I have to go to that night for my work for continuing education class. We have to get continuing education credits every two years. We have to renew our license, so we have to make sure we have enough credits for that. So I brought these out. I just thought they were really cute. They're little paper and pencils from Sweet Avis Paper. And I'm going to use a half box because that's pretty much going to be my night. Because it's going to be a long, boring, drawn out class. So I'm going to use, I don't want to use a pink one already, but um, maybe I'll use this pale one here. And we'll just put it here. And then I know Kylie's going to have a game, but... I think my parents are probably going to have to take her, grandma and grandpa, because I'll be out of class, so, which is a bummer because I'm going to have to miss her game, but I have to take those classes, so I'm going to use the paper and the pencil somehow, and just put them in here, and I just think these are so cute, so, yeah, to mark my class, and which side do I want to put it on? I think I like it over here, so, yeah, I'm going to do that. And then I could write in the time and stuff. And then when I find out what Kylie's schedule is, I could put her volleyball game in. But I don't know. I'm pretty sure she has one, but I don't want to put it in if there's not, you know. So I'm going to wait on that. Uh, Wednesday is my day off. And I usually work on Etsy stuff that day. So I did bring out some little... Um, these are her eight Sweet Avis Papers little snowballs. So I'm going to use that for working on Etsy orders. And I think I'm going to use another half box. So maybe I'll use the pink this time or the blue. I'm going to use the blue because that's pretty much takes up a lot of my day. So I'm going to put that up here. I did also start um, doing some more cleaning on Wednesdays just so it's not all on the weekend so I'm going to try to do that again this week just kind of split it up so let's do that let's put this here cute and for fun I think I'm going to put a little heart so I brought these little foiled hearts from our shop out and they're in silver and I think I'm going to use this medium blue one no the light blue this is an oopsie too so I'm going to put it here or here. I'm going to put it up here. And that'll be for working on Etsy stuff. So I also want to do some laundry and vacuuming this day. So I brought these out from Lexi Kylie Designs. And I thought I could use these for my cleaning. And I'm going to use the pink because that's the color that matches the kit. Kind of. It's a little bit darker, but that's okay. I'm going to put that all the way down at the bottom. Kind of. So let's do that. And yeah. Oh, that wasn't right. Let's see if I can lift that up and squeeze it over a little bit. So I guess the corner of the house, probably. Yeah, that should work. These are kind of hard to line up. Okay, that's good. And then I'm going to put a little checklist in there because I'm going to do laundry and vacuuming that day. So I'm going to use these little asterisks from our shop and just put, so I can write each one in. And these are teeny tiny, but I just think they'll be cute right there. 
And these are in silver foil too. You definitely need tweezers when you use these ones. Oops, didn't stick. There we go. So that'll be to mark cleaning and, or vacuuming and laundry. And then I think I'm gonna break that up with a little washi. So I have this, and I'm just gonna split up the space with this washi. And again, I'm not sure where this is from. I wanna say, oh, there's something on that. This is from Joann's or Michael's. I don't think it's from Hobby Lobby, but again, I could be totally wrong. So I'm gonna do this because I didn't bring out any of my little bow dividers that I like to use. So I'm gonna try something here just for fun. Not sure how it's gonna look, but we'll see. There we go. I'm gonna split up the space and then I thought I could put one of these little bows right there, but it might be too big now that I'm looking at it. So maybe like that medium color one. Hmm. Just thought it would be cute to kind of put that right in the middle here. Yeah, I'm gonna do that. Okay, just to fill up that space. Okay, and then on to Thursday, I like to do our meal prepping. So let me scoot this up. And let's see, I brought out these from uh, Planning Like a Pro, and this had like a lot of the colors in this kit, so that's why I brought these out for meal planning. And I'm going to put it up here like usual, but I think I'm going to use the blue one this week. So let me, whoops, let me grab that and we'll just pop him up here. That should work. Okay, what else is going on? Nothing on Thursday because I don't know about Kylie's game yet. So I'm going to leave that day blank for now and move on to Friday. Friday is payday for me for my other job. So I am going to use, I think she had some payday stickers in the kit, like a little icon. So I think I'm going to use those. Yeah, she has this little mini bag. So I'm going to put that up top here to mark payday for my regular job. So I'm just going to put it up here and I'm not going to write anything in yet, but I'll write that in later. For Friday and then what else is going on oh I need to pay my taxes that day that's such a bummer so <laughs> um, yeah let me use a what I think I'll use one of these little boxes here for that and I brought out the funniest little stickers for that um, these the shop I don't think is open any longer but I have these from Little Paw Plans and the cat's crying, so that was perfect for paying your taxes. So I am going to use one of those on Friday, and I think I'll use this one because there's already a lot of blue that day. So yeah, put this right here, and let's hope I'm getting that straight. There we go. And I think I'll have room to do the big one. So. Oh, I don't think it's cut all the way. No, it's not. So let me use this one here. And that'll be okay. So that's for paying my taxes. Bummer. Okay. And then I need to take Kylie to her dad's that night. So I usually mark that with a car. And I saw a cute little car in the kit. So I am going to use that in the icons right here. So I'm going to put this down here and I'll use a little thing. She has a lot of little things so yeah. What color? Maybe, well, darn, I'm gonna have to use pink. And this is pink so that's okay. I'm not gonna let it bother me. I need to take color dot, yeah. And I'm gonna put it down here because that'll be at night. And then that way, if we do anything else that night, I can have a little space there. Like if we go to dinner or anything like that, or we decide to go to the gym. Sometimes we add an extra day in, so I'm going to leave that blank for now. Um, and then Saturday, 
we have an eyebrow appointment in the morning, but I want to put my weekend banner down. So she has a really cute one in the kit. So I am going to use that for sure because I love these little boots. So I think I'm going to put my weekend banner up here, um, either here or here. So let's see. I never really put it up at the very top, so maybe I'll do that just for something different. But I do want to add a little foil to it, so I'm going to scooch it over to the left here. And I want to put either a heart or a bow right there. So I brought, you know, the same ones out, and I'm going to pop one. Of, I'm going to use the bow just for fun, just to add a little something to the weekend banner. And it's not going to fit all the way, so let's see. How can I do this? And just cover up the D a little bit. Or I can move it over. I might have to go get some undo. Yeah, let me grab some undo and move that over real quick. Hang on one sec. All right, so I removed the weekend banner and I put the bow down first. So hopefully I can fit this in up top here. And it's going to have to kind of go over a little bit to fit. So let's see if I did it. Yes. So I can just snip the little end off here. That's okay. I could have gone over a tiny bit more, but that's all right. So we're going to leave it like that um, for the weekend banner. I think that looks really cute. Um, so on Sunday, first thing we do is we go to church and I need to film my plan with me and get groceries that day. So I think I'm going to put that up here. Um, actually, I'm on Saturday. What am I talking about? So Saturday is cleaning day and I have an eyebrow appointment. So I think I'm going to put the eyebrow appointment in the morning because it is in the morning. But I don't really plan chronologically all the time. So I brought these out from Soda Pop Studio. And a lot of these colors match. I mean are brighter so this one matches the best so I'm going to use this light pink one here for our eyebrow appointment in the morning up here and do I have a lot going that day kind of so yeah I'm gonna put it right here and then I'll leave that little space yeah so that will be for our eyebrow appointment and I'm kind of feeling like I want to add some foil to that. So I'm going to put this heart up there. I know there's already a heart, but I'm going to put my heart there. There we go. And then I do need to clean that day and go to the gym. So I think I'm going to put my gym sticker first. And unfortunately, all of these are pink. But I do, there is a workout sticker from the kit, so I can use that instead for my workout here. And I'll just use that same washi. Yeah, that'll work. So let's do that instead of using the ones that I was using. So did I forget to put one on Wednesday? I did, so I need to put a workout sticker on Wednesday too. So I think I can just line this up here. Yeah, that'll work. So let's take this off first and then I'll put the other one on Wednesday because I forgot it. I always forget at least one thing when I'm doing my plan with me. It never fails. Okay. So I'm just going to place that right in the center here for my workout. Okay, and then I want to just, before I forget, put a workout sticker on Wednesday somewhere. Maybe I'll squeeze it up there. So these are the same ones from Soda Pop Studio. And yeah, I'm just going to squeeze it up top for my workout. There we go. Okay, and then back to Saturday. Um, cleaning day, and I want to, I need to pay my bills that day. So for cleaning, I'm going to use the same little cleaning house, I think, from Lexi Kylie Designs, maybe. Yeah, I'm going to use that same one. I'm going to use the pink because the other colors are too bright. So I know this isn't the exact same color, but that's okay. And basically, I just clean my whole house, so I don't need a little checklist there. 
let's do that. And then for paying bills, she has like a little bill due sticker. So I'm going to use that down here at the bottom. And I feel like I put that clean house sticker really crooked. So it's hard to tell. Does that look crooked? Let me just look at it. Maybe a little bit. I don't know. We're just going to leave it. So that'll be for paying my 15th bills. And I'm just going to leave that like that. And I'm tempted to add a bow. I've been watching my friend Amy from Two Little Bow Babies add bows to everything. And I'm like, that's so cute. I want to do that. So I'm going to steal her idea. She won't mind. So this is for paying the 15th. And I can just put it maybe off to the side. It might be a little too big. Let's see. Let me grab my tweezers here. That might help. Yeah, that's going to be too big. I can put it right there. Stay. Okay. So that'll be for, I wanted it to kind of go in the center there, but it's too big. So we're just going to do that for paying my bills on Saturday. And then I think that's it. Yeah, that's it for Saturday. Sunday, we have church in the morning. So I brought these little church labels from Soda Pop Studio. And these are on matte sticker paper. So I'm going to put that up top here. And I think I'm going to use, what color? Maybe blue? Yeah, I'll use the blue one. I think this blue will look best. So let's do that. Mm -hmm. Sticking. Whoops. Let me just peel that up. Okay. Sticking to my finger. <laughs> okay. So let's put that over here. And yeah, that should work. And I kind of want to put a little strip of washi just to divide the space. So I'm going to use this one here. Where's the end? The silver one that I used over on the other side. So I kind of wrinkled that a little bit. That's okay, it's still gonna fit. And I want it to go there, <laughs> where the, right where the heart is. So let me see if I can lift that up without ruining it. Ugh, foil is so like temperamental and I think I just ruined that sticker. Darn it. Oh well, I have more so I can replace it. Let's just put this down. Um, this isn't going as I planned. That's okay. Alright. So I might just remove that heart from the eyebrow appointment. One. Yeah, that's pretty much done. So I'm going to remove that with some undo really quick. Hang on one sec. Okay, so I removed that heart. It's still kind of drying. But, um, yeah, I'm going to just replace it with one of these. I have one left, so that'll be okay. And I'm going to use my little tweezers to put that down right like that. There we go. I hate it when I ruin stickers. Okay. So then on, what else is on Sunday? Oh, I need to fill my plan with me and get some groceries. So I'm going to put that down here. So for filming my plan with me, I'm going to use a half box. Um have a couple here. So I think I'm going to use, do I want to use the pink one? Yeah, I'm going to use the pink one. And I'm going to use this up top here. And this kit didn't come with like any planners, so I brought out this little sheet here from our shop in silver foil. And I'm going to use one of those. So maybe the blue for that one. And I also brought out some little cameras from the shop called Lovely Plannery and I'm gonna use another one of one of these with it so I think I'm gonna use the light pink color here these are on matte sticker paper so this will be for filming my plan with me trying to decide which way I want it to go yeah I liked it better that way so yeah we're gonna do that just like that and I'm gonna pop these down um, I'm going to put it on this side. This side. Uh, yeah, I guess it's going there. I'm not going to fight with it anymore. <laughs> Alright, and then I need to get groceries that day, and that's the last thing. So, she has a little grocery sticker icon here. 
so I thought I saw one. Yeah, this little shopping cart. So I'm going to use that down at the bottom to get groceries. And I don't think I'm going to put anything behind it. I think I'm just going to put it down and then write it in. So I'll put it down here. No, I'm going to put it here just in case we do something else. And then I'll leave that space blank in case something else comes up. So I think that's it for this week. Um, yeah, so let me put everything back together here in my planner. And it was a hard, I had a hard time picking out some clips this week because I only have a bunch of gold ones. So I had to find, I need to get more uh, silver bow clips from two little bow babies because I don't have very many silver ones. So, but I don't really use silver very often, but okay. So this is the one I brought out. This is from two little bow babies on Etsy. I do have a coupon code listed down below for 15% off if you guys are interested in her clips. She has really nice clips. So there we go. And I thought that looks really cute. So, and that's in silver with silver glitter. And that's my spread for the week. I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video. If you did, please give this video a thumbs up. And don't forget to hit that subscribe button. I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye-bye.